Good morning, boys and girls. You just listened to the story of Gingerbread Baby. So now we're going to do a craft activity. All right, please get out this worksheet. It says, I would catch the gingerbread baby by, and let's think of some ways that maybe we could catch the gingerbread baby. Hmm. What's one way you think we could catch the gingerbread baby? Hmm. We could set a trap. I would catch the gingerbread baby by setting a trap, period. How else do you think you could catch the gingerbread baby? How did Matty the little boy catch the gingerbread baby? Do you remember? He built a gingerbread house, right? So I would catch the gingerbread baby by making, making a, and I don't, I'm not gonna fit gingerbread there. That's a long word, ginger. bread house. Period. What's another way you think we could catch the gingerbread baby? Oh, I like that idea. Make a gingerbread family. I would catch the gingerbread baby by making a, it's not gonna fit there, ginger bread. So here are three ideas to finish this sentence. I would catch the gingerbread baby by setting a trap. I would catch the gingerbread baby by making a gingerbread house. I would catch the gingerbread baby by making a gingerbread family. So those are just some ideas. You can come up with your own idea too. So you can pause the video if you want to use one of these ideas or come up with your own idea. Okay, and then draw a picture of what you picked. So draw a picture that matches your words. Alrighty, now let's do the fun part. Let's make the craft. Alright, get out your cute little gingerbread. Here's your gingerbread baby. Alrighty, now Let's start with the green bow. If you're a girl, you're gonna put the green bow up top. If you're a boy, you're going to put it right here. So I'm a girl, so I'm gonna put mine up top and you're gonna glue it right on top. So get out your glue stick. If you wanna make a girl, you glue it on top. If you wanna make a boy, you glue it as a bow tie. I'm gonna make a girl because I am a girl. There's that. Then let's glue the gingerbread baby's heart. Put a little glue on the back. Stick the heart on. Wherever you wanna put it really, it's up to you. The icing, I'm gonna put my icing, you can get creative and put your icing wherever you'd like. 
I'm gonna put a piece of icing here. I'm gonna put a piece of icing on the other leg. I'm gonna put a piece of icing here. It's a little long, so I'm gonna just cut it a little. I'm gonna do a snip and a snip. Put one there. But you can put your icing anywhere. You could make your icing your um, gingerbread baby's hair if you wanted. And I'm gonna put another piece of icing on the other side. But I'm gonna do a little snip. A little snip and snip. Then I'm going to, oh, we can't forget the gingerbread baby's face, right? You should have some little teeny beady eyeballs. They were very tricky to cut out and glue th them on your gingerbread baby. And then you have your gingerbread baby's nose, which is this hot pink oval. And I'm gonna put mine right near my eyes. And then, with a pencil, a crayon, a marker, you're gonna draw your gingerbread baby's face. And I'm gonna draw a smile on my gingerbread baby. And finally, I'm going to put little buttons on my gingerbread baby. There's one button. I'm gonna do a pattern. Blue, pink, blue. And there's my gingerbread baby. Isn't she cute? And there you have it. That's how you make your gingerbread baby. I hope this video was helpful. I hope you enjoyed making your gingerbread baby and coming up with a way to catch the gingerbread baby. And I can't wait to see all the different ways that you came up with. All right, I miss you so much. Remember, wash your hands. Love you, bye.